Hi kids, Grandpa here. Today we're going to work some more on the tire changer and make it stronger. We're to the point now where we need to do some welding. Welding is when you take two pieces of metal and melt them together. One of my favorite ways of welding is with a wire feed welder. The wire feed welder uses electricity to generate a tremendous amount of heat which melts both the wire that comes out of the tip and the metal that you're trying to weld. When that electricity starts to go through the wire and into the metal, it becomes very hot and melts the wire and the metal together. You can see how when I pull the trigger, wire comes out. So, let's get back to our project. We're just about ready to weld this together. Let's take a look. We've got a longer bolt on that and a, and a washer there to space it out so it doesn't hit this thing here. We've got that all clamped together and we've got the other one clamped together. Now what we need to do is hook up the wire feed welder. Take a look at me. The welding from the wire feed is very hot and extremely bright. So we have to use a welder's hood so that it doesn't burn our holes. You want to make sure that if you ever see anybody welding like this, that you don't look at the light. Because even though you're a ways away, that might be very badly burn your eyes. You won't feel it right at first, but several hours later, your eyes will just burn to go, and they'll be red. Okay, that was done with a grinding wheel. Now we're going to use a wire brush. Here's the wire brush we're going to use. I think we're about cleaned up. There's the one part of the tire iron and there's the other part. Now that came together pretty well and so did that took the bolt out there and this side to here came together reasonably well. This thing looks kind of ratty, doesn't it? Do you think it'd look better if we painted it? I do. That'll also keep it from rusting, won't it? I've sure got a lot of tools out, don't I? What do we do when we have a lot of stuff out? Yeah, we clean it up. So. I'm going to clean this mess up. Now that looks better. Do you clean your messes up? I sure hope so. Shall we get this thing painted?
Well, I think that's enough paint. Now we'll do the black parts. Let's let that dry and we'll check on it in the morning. Now that the paint is all dry, I think it looks pretty good. Now we need to put it back together. We need to start out by putting the screw back on the machine. That came together pretty well. Let's take this down to the garage and bolt it back to its base. Hey Callie, I think I finished it. We put the braces on. It's a lot stronger now. And I think this screw will work better too. Time to bolt it back together. Wow, that seems a lot stronger. What do you guys think? We'll come back another time and I'll show you how we do tires on this machine.